Hello guys, thanks for watching. I am the Block Hop. I'm going to show you how to port forward your router to run Mountain Blade servers. Now, first we're going to want to open our internet browser. I have Google Chrome and Firefox, but since Firefox is widely used, most of you have it. I'm going to use that. Now we're going to type in up here. We want to get our default gateway, so we're going to go down to, to, to search. We're going to search run. See it's up there. So we're going to click on it. I want you to type in C M D. That stands for command, and it launches the Windows System 32 command window. Now we're going to type in IP config, and it has all of our stuff that we need. Now the IPv4 address is the LAN address. Remember, remember that, because all IP 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 addresses are different, even LAN IP addresses. So what you see here might not be exactly mine. I'm oh, sorry, might not be exactly yours. So here's a default gately. Right. Yeah. So here's the default. computer has a different one. Here's a default gateway right here. 192.168.0.1 now we're gonna we're gonna type that in in the internet browser. And it just takes it just takes a second. Let's we'll type it in. This nifty little screen pops up where you can test the modem, set it up quickly, wi wirelessly set it up, and other utilities to keep it running. Now we want to go to advanced setup just because that's where the port port forwarding stuff is. Now, we're going to go down to, under security, we're going to go to advanced port forwarding. I apologize in advance. I am very sick right now, but I'm trying to help you. Alright. Now, we're going to go, I'm going to go give you the ports for Mountain Blade servers. In a second, I'm going to find, find the text document I put it in. You know what's really weird, though? Um, Mountain the uh, Tail Worlds, they never released any sort of port to help you port forward. Now, I'm giving these to, uh, to you because I, I, I like to see some more um, servers out there. Because um, I've, I've looked around, there's absolutely no tutorials, no help videos, no not even a, a, a list of Mount, Mountain Blade Warband server ports. Now, I've went on portforward.com, I haven't seen any um, 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 ports for, for Mountain Blade Warband, but anyways, back back to the tutorial. Um, I'm gonna see see how this is TCP um, seven two forty. We're gonna copy that. We're gonna put it in starting port and ending port. Make sure you got your LAN IP address. Sounds like Omega and Alpha. I'm just saying. Thank you, Dr. Pwn. Hey, you're welcome. Now, we're going to type in our LAN IP address. I again, if, y if you need to um, pull up your LAN IP, IP address, you need to type in run <coughs> cmd and then IP config. And my LAN IP address is right, th uh, right there, which is the IPv4 address. Now, I memorized my IP ad, uh, uh, my LAN IP address. I strongly suggest that you do the same. And we're gonna click apply. And it's gonna take a it's gonna take a a little bit for the uh, router to receive it and um, set it up. Now let's go check. It didn't go. Let me let me try it again. While we're waiting, it's, it's it's sending out to the server, uh, the router, sorry, and the router is trying to receive it. It's going to set it up. We have to wait for it to go. Now we're going to see if it went. Yep, it went right there. And this is what you want to be looking at. S seven two forty. That's the 
port. Okay, now we're going to do the other port. Let's just go over here. It's right here. Now, 7241. Now we want to copy that. Paste it into each little box. Starting and ending port. We want to do make sure TCP, leave that alone for right now. Now we're gonna want. Now we're wanna we wanna do the LAN IP. Make make sure this is your LAN IP, because mine's totally different from yours. I'm pretty sure. Each computer has a different one. Yeah, each com like, like Doc said, each computer on a network has a different one. Let's go ch check that if that worked. It didn't work. Let's do it again. And it's gonna take take a while to send it to the router, and the router's gonna receive it, and it's gonna say, "Okay, I'm gonna open this port for you, and for your server, and for your computer, and it's gonna work." And it did. Let's see. Let's check it, and it did. Cool. Okay, that port and this port. Now we're gonna do both of the, that one port again. We're gonna do both of them over again, but. We're gonna do. Okay, now we're gonna do this in UDP. Type our LAN IP address in there. And click apply. Now we're gonna wait for it to continue. It's saying connecting, so. It's getting the feedback. Let's put it on the router. And we're going to get the other port. And we're going to put that at UDP as well. IP address. Now we want to click apply. A big apply button. I love that. Click the big apply button. Wait for it to connect. Wait for it to finish. Now let's go ch check them out. Let's see if they worked. Now they're in there. All right. Now that's in there. That's good. Now, just a few things I want to say. Thanks. Thank you for watching. Um, ho hope that you enjoyed this video. Hope it helped everyone that's had the problem. Now, if you'd like more. Tutorial docs and, t and tutorials on how to port forward and and all this network and stuff. I've been trying. I'm trying to teach you here. Um, please give me, give me a subscribe or or a video response. Telling me you, what you like me to do. Uh, I'll gladly teach you how to do it uh, within my knowledge. And anyways, thanks for watching. Bye bye.